Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Red Hat Linux 9 on VMware Workstation Player. Go to any search engine and search for download Red Hat 9. Then click on this Red Hat Enterprise Linux download. Then click on download. See, here we have the latest version that is 9, 8.6, 8.4, 7.9, 8 8.2 and older versions. Now click on this DVD ISO file that is x86 64 bit. Its a size is 7.99 gigabytes. Click on it. See, if you don't have Red Hat account, Click on this register for Red Hat account. I have already registered Red Hat account. Then click on next. Then provide the password. See. Once we enter credentials, it automatically started downloading. If you go to downloads, See, RHL 9 x86 64 DVD is downloading. I am cancelling this download because I have already downloaded. In your case, wait until download completes. Once download is completed, this is my VMware Workstation 16 player. Now click on this create a new virtual machine. Here select the installer disk image file. Then browse. Then go to downloads where we have downloaded. See, RHS base OS 9. Select it. And now click on next. See, it has taken Linux. Don't bother about this version. Then click on next. Here provide the name for virtual machine. I am giving RHL 9. Then choose the directory to store the this file. By default, it is going to store in C users. Choose the location where you have enough space. I am going with the defaults. If you want, you can change it by clicking on this browse button. Then click on next. Here we have to provide the odd size. I am giving 40 gigabytes. Then click on next. These are the summary of virtual machine. If you want to change, then click on this customize hardware. If you want to increase Memory says just change here by typing 4096. Then click on close. See the memory size has been changed. Now click on finish. Now click on this power on button. Use up and down arrows and select the type of installation. I am going to select install Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.0. Press enter. Select the language and click on continue. See, this begin installation has been grayed out. Why? Because these root password and installation destination fields are mandatory. Click on this installation destination. I am going with default installation destination. Then click on done. Then set the root, root password by clicking on this root password. If you want to 
lock the root account just click on the checkbox otherwise i am not going to lock it then click on done now we are able to begin installation before it was grayed out click on begin installation installation has been started See, this process takes time. I am pausing this video. See, installation has been completed successfully. Now click on Reboot System. Use up and down arrows and select the version and press enter. Now click on start setup. This is the privacy. If you want to enable local services, enable it. If you want to disable, just click on this one. Either option, whatever you want. Then click on next. If you want to connect to any of these links, click on any of the links. Otherwise, click on skip. I am going to skip. Here provide the name. Here I am giving name as administrator. Then click on next. Provide the password for the user administrator. All done. Click on start using Red Hat Linux Enterprise Linux. Click on no thanks. Now open terminal. Activities. Then click on terminal. Now verify now installed Red Hat Linux Enterprise Linux is 9 version or not. More slash etc os hyphen release. Notice output here version is 9.0. Name is Red Hat Linux Enterprise Linux. ID like Fedora. So in this video we have seen how to download and install Red Hat Enterprise Linux on VMware Workstation Player. For more videos please subscribe my channel. Thank you.